the following tag team contest is coming from one ball. Introducing first, the real life Nicky Chuckles, at his most combined weight of 465 pounds. Got me, Paradise. I, this is one of my little beats I've had around here. These are called old school reunion shows, and I don't remember these guys being in the old building that I used to partake in back in the old days over in Jeffersonville. I feel bad for ever, whoever's going against Madman Pondo, and if that stop sign gets involved, they're going to be stopped before they know it. I like that best well, I don't silo. Even know who's coming out, and I can only tell you who I'm going to be for. American assassin! Well, he's wearing it. Looks like combat fatigue or something. He just. And one half of your host, from the Green Party, will perish happily in South Carolina, the American assassin! Looking good! United States Marine Corps representing America! Looks like you got to skip out on boot camp. Yeah. Paradise Island is in America. The kingdom of paradise is its own sovereign nation. I have diplomatic immunity. I, I can put did. my thumb wherever I want. I hear you have many times. Where is Joe Wheeler? Well, after seeing that uh, exertion that he put out in that last match, we may not see Wheeler the rest of the night. I know what I said earlier about Madman Pondo, but this assassin, look, it looks like he's been putting on a little weight Oh yeah, he's got, he's got a few inches on him there, without a doubt, probably a few pounds as well, but uh, I do not recall this music that's being played right now. Well, remember, Mickey Knuckles, she's the, she's the, she's the intangible. Spit it out. I can't. You can told that all the time. That's what she said. That's what he said. I, look, I'm not into this. Hamana, hamana, hamana. I'm, like, I'm like, don't go there unless you really want to. I have. It's all right. I don't I want to. Notes here on the American Assassin's tag team partner, and based on the name, he's the most mysterious. Based on his name, it looks like he's one of those guys who waits for his music to play for 20 minutes before he comes out. What an R I do! Well, I say we ring the bell and give him a 10 count if he's too scared to come out and face the competition. You think that's it? I thought he was just being cool. No, I think he's, I think he's scared to death. <laughs> or maybe he's in the back being... <laughs> Having second thoughts, you think, maybe? It's the idea! Oh, no, you've seen that face before. That's not who it is. Oh. I I thought he was going to the other country. And his tag team partner from Parks Unknown, weighing in at 200 pounds, Scorpion. He's lost some weight. Yeah, it looked like he went and gave blood and forgot to say when. American Sasson looking to start it off. Looks, gonna, looks like it's gonna be Assassin and, and Shiloh Joe. I think he'd have got a bigger reaction if he'd have just stayed in the back. American Assassin definitely height and weight advantage. Shiloh turned him around. Did he grab it? Did he tried to grab an ear, but he's wearing a mask, so it didn't work. Hip toss! There we go. I always hate it when someone tries to grab an ear and instead they grab a mask. He can't grab Probably happens to you all the time, don't it? He, couldn't, he can't grab an ear, he can't grab the hair, but he can grab that mask, and if it were to slip off, if this were Mexican mythology, he would be embarrassed, his family would be shamed. I don't know what happens in America, how, though. How, how well-versed are you on Mexican mythology? I'm very well-versed. I know there's a guy who has a monkey tail. There's a guy who dresses like a bunch of numbers. I'd like to meet the guy with the monkey tail, to be honest with you. I have. Guys, Stop we figured. have crazy nights. We have a 
have a great card on tap for tonight. I just want to talk about some of the things that we will see here tonight. The OVW champion Cliff Compton will be making some Whoa. remarks. Whoa, we got the champ here tonight? And he is here Hell tonight. Yeah. And you got to believe that he's going to be talking about that big Saturday night special, a ladder match coming up on March 5th with some very high stakes. That's triple threat. The low rider Matt Barella and Mike Mondo, who's I think cross to the other side of the tracks as of late. Well, as my son, the Prince, calls them, the Three Stooges. Everybody's sick and tired of seeing them. Moose has been dominating out here on OVW television. Not factored into that match, and he ain't happy about it, neither I, of them. I can't disagree with Moose, the human train wreck, walking through people, literally rampaging OVW. But you got to admit, Mr. Media, he's the one with the goal right now. And Speaking of train wreck, I see the guy with the paint on his face is still standing outside the ring here. Doesn't look to be all that concerned that he's in a match, does he? Here we go, Mad Man Pondo is a little irate. That's one of the advantages. You can still go to the eyes if he's wearing a match. Big body slam well, didn't seem to hurt him. Maybe he missed. I don't doesn't, know. doesn't always work on Spider-Man, though, because he's got those special special glazes over his eyes. Oh, methodical! Methodical! What else? Wow. Uh, what else we have on store to for tonight? It's a good time to talk about it. I want to hear. I want to hear your thoughts on the OVW return of the Iron Man. Scorpion Splash! Scorpion Splash! Can we sure it's what that was? I don't know. Iron Man might come. Oh, oh baby! Oh my God! Yeah. Hollywood Hogan. I mean, uh, Shiloh Jones is knocked out. Are we gonna see a Scorpion Deathlock here? Are we gonna see a Scorpion yeah. Deathlock here? He's got it Something sixed like in. One. He's got it the sixed The Scorpion in. grip hold. Pondo. Well, there, there goes Mad go. Man Pondo. Yeah. Mad Man Pondo thinks this guy's a joke. He just said it. Pondo said all he said it to saying. Mickey Knuckles. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Yep. Mad Man Pondo, both feet weren't on the ground. That tag wasn't there over the top rope. There we go. See what Pondo. Rules. Well, he just picked up dead weight right there. Oh. Can not, do it. Not much of it, but he we got cover. it up. Two. <laughs> Thought that was gonna be it. American Assassin be better off come over here and ask Mickey Knuckles to be his partner. Pondo, I mean, you got to admit, he's stretching the rules, but those are the rules. He has a five count. I think he left a body print of Scorpion lying right there in the ring. Here we go, Shiloh Jones come to work. We haven't seen Shiloh in months, at least six, right to the nose. Right to where the nose would be on most We people. have not seen Shiloh Jones in some time, but he's looking to be in great And Mickey Knuckles getting her cheapos in. Mickey Knuckles Knuckle. making this an extremely fair fight. Right on the rope. I told you she's the intangible. She's the one that's gonna make, the, that could make the difference in this match. Mad the X Factor, if you will. Madman Pondo, if he wasn't mad before he got out here, I bet he is now. Were they ever clients of yours, Kenny? Uh, no, no, there were no clients in that ring of mine right now. Mickey Knuckles and Madman Pondo have their own style, that's for sure. They, uh, they were not really part of the uh, old school regime over in Jeffersonville, and needless to say, uh, this thing out here taking his horse weapon right now from Shiloh and Knuckles. Now, I don't see why Jones is resorting. Methodical, is that what they're calling him? Me very methodical yeah. everything okay. about everything. I got you. I don't know why Jones is resorting to this kind of tactic. In my opinion, he's never looked better. He was a competitor, uh, television champion earlier in his career. Just returning to tonight's first appearance. He used to be in great shape, and now he's doing this kind of thing, attacking people on the outside of the ring, taking cheap shots. We got a cover here. This looks like it could be it, and the assassin in to make yeah. the save for his tag team partner. From South Carolina, he doesn't mind us knowing where he's from, but he won't reveal that face of his. Leads me to believe he's probably horribly ugly. Paris Island. They got away with that one. To be a kip up. A kip up with the Scorpion. What's this oh, going to be? Oh, look out. He's got a second win. Not too bad. <laughs> Kips up and finds his face flat Not on the mat. For that. Five minutes have expired in this match. Five minutes remain. There we go, Madman Bondo taking a shot at the assassin. Look like it might be a, from the Marine Corps or something, maybe. I'm not sure. He is a Marine, former Marine. Marine. Former Marine. Oh, what a move by Methodico and out of nowhere. Out of the way in the nick of time. Where the hell did that come from? I don't know. He must have a steel arm. And fortunately, he tags in the big Marine. He may have spent all he had right there. Is this the opportunity for a comeback for this team? Ladies and gentlemen, blood runs cold in this arena. 
You can feel it. Double well, noggin knuckle. Yeah, absolutely, that's what that was. It stole the words right out of my mouth. Mickey Maggie Knuckles. Knuckles. What's she doing? Oh, what? she's showing it. Ew, that is so nasty. If she did that to me, that would be so gross. I don't know what that ref's getting paid, but it ain't enough. Good night. Oh, he took his head off. Bent the stop sign. He took sign. his head off the stop sign. There's the cover. There's the count. There's the victory. Yeah, so much for your Marine Corps. Hoorah! The winners of this match, Matt and Hondo in Shadow Joe! Give the assist to Mickey Knuckles. She distracted the referee and created the opportunity necessary for Hondo and Joe well, to come more, up with a win. More importantly, Wirt was methodical when you needed him. I don't think. I don't think they needed it. Shiloh Jones and Madman Pondo just pure outmatched these guys, whether they took shortcuts or not. I think they were just toying with them. Indeed.